Hi friends. So today what we're going to do is we're going to make some spider web pretzels, which is really, really fun. So all you need is pretzel sticks, pretzel rods, anything of like the sticks. It's not really going to work if you use a regular twisty pretzel. Um, so right here I have pretzel sticks and you're going to need white chocolate or regular chocolate, whatever kind of chocolate you want. And I have this melted down like this. In my microwave, it took about a minute and 15 seconds. Every microwave is different. You can use chips, you can use melts, you can use any kind of melty chocolate, you can use M&Ms if you want, um, whatever, whatever you want. So now I'm gonna take my chocolate and I'm gonna put it into my Ziploc bag. And I'm gonna try to get it in the corner because we're gonna cut it and we're gonna do what's called piping to make our web. I'm just gonna do one more scoop. And then you can always start with a little and add more. If you use too much at once, it's gonna be harder for you to use the bag. So see how I'm putting it all towards the bottom corner. I'm just gonna give it a little twist. And I'm gonna cut just a little bit from the corner of my bag. So now you can see, we're gonna take our piping bag and we're just gonna drag it all along the pretzels to make it look like a spider web. You don't have to get super fancy. You don't have to make it look exactly like a spider web. Whatever you want to do, whatever's in your imagination. I suggest using wax paper versus uh, tin foil. Uh, tin foil is going to stick because you're going to put these in the fridge or the freezer to set the chocolate. And you don't want tin foil to stick because you don't really want to eat tin foil because that's definitely not a yummy thing to eat and that's pretty much it you just make the circle 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 you can put like a little bit in the middle like that branch it off and what I didn't do that you should do which is gonna be a lot easier for you in the long run just like we put a little bit in the middle right here put some in the middle and then stick the pretzels on there so that your pretzels will stick in that web shape and it'll stay together, hopefully, when it's cooled down. And that's it, super easy. And now I know what you can do. You can use the little chocolates. If you want, you can make spiders, or I have some Halloween sprinkles. I'm gonna put some in my hand and just sprinkle them on the ends. And just sprinkle them all around. And it'll stick to the chocolate and it'll be extra deliciousness and extra fun for your spider webs and then as soon as you're done with your spider web just pop it in the fridge or the freezer let it set as soon as you can touch it and it feels hard then it's pretty much set and you can pull it out um, just be careful because it might break you can try to use a spatula underneath um, but that's up to you have fun. Happy Halloween.